Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Place Tales of Arise. Today, let's go ahead and look at this skit, Floral I've Binds. I noticed that sometimes we come across enemies who fight like you and try to dodge our attacks at the last second. I hate those guys. I can get some hits in when they move in to attack, but otherwise they slip past damn near everything else I throw at them. If what you're seeking is a way to more reliably hit them, there is a solution. Shoot Try them? Try to outclass them on reflexes? That too? I possess the ability to command Earth elemental beings to some extent. They emerge as the land itself and take root on my command. They will swiftly bind the enemies. Oh, is that At what your skill does? You can dispatch them. Huh? Uh, what he means is that he can make plants grow to hold the enemies in place. At least I think that's probably what he's saying. I'm glad at least one of us understands him. So basically, if we find an enemy that likes to dodge, we should let Doholim handle it. I shall do what I can within my modest means to help. Honestly, I was just using you for extra damage. Ah, uh, hi. Um, oh, I want to sell my fish. That's not that bad? So, yeah, that's actually not that bad. It's like 450 per fish. And it doesn't really require anything. Infantry sealed. It is weaker than what I have. So I am not going to. Heavy treat is a lot of money. Um, so I'm not going to get rid. Oh, red, red jasmine. Right, 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 right. Yeah, I'm not going to. What was I saying? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, yeah, we need to buy some of these. There you go. Ah, that's too many. I'll just leave it at that for right now. But, um, oh, yeah, I was like... It's not that bad. I probably won't... S for the fish. I probably won't spend so much time trying to grind for fish. And there's probably fish that are going to cost way more than um, new animals. We're going to eat some horses? I mean, I hear horse tastes fine. Honestly, never eaten it, I think. I, I've never had Ikea meatballs, so... Um, so, yeah, I mean... All right, check that out. I you guess? You can never be too prepared. But did we have to spend so much? What are you talking about? Oh, on the life bottle? Yeah, Kisara. Yes, I do. Okay? You guys die. I mean, I die a lot too. But it's what mostly a choice on my end. No, it's not. That Shut up. That is standard issue for the men in Sea and Guard, right? Originally, I've added some flair to it in a lot of places. I noticed. Especially with that open back. I do like her armor. We pride ourselves on never showing our back to our enemies. It's my way of making myself live up to that. Plus, it makes it that much lighter and easier to maintain. Hmm. Dohalim, do you have anything to say about this? Every guardsman is allowed to wear their armor as they see fit. And you, La? Huh? Why are you asking me? Because she's, she's asking you if she thinks it's hot. That's what she's getting at. She was asking you to be perv, pretty much. Um... Yeah, I guess I'll keep cooking with Dolholm just in case he has uh, an emblem. I must admit, for it. I'm rather proud of this dish. Do you want to go and check out some of the other fishing ponds? Uh, Kisara. Kisara, let's talk for a bit. But um, yeah, I guess we could check out some of the other fishing ponds. I kind of thought we were gonna get a tutorial for Dolholm stuff. Before we go, but I guess you not. guys have everything? Um So yeah, let's go ahead. There's a fishing spot there. Now was this a fishing spot over here? There was a dock. But I kind of thought eventually it would be a fishing spot. I know there is one. Then again, that dude probably listed them, right? Like when that he was, was uh telling us we went on those places but we'll check it out if it is it is if it's not I mean it looks like it is but I guess it's not how very disappointing uh, we do know no one is actually literally right there so let's go check that out 
Now we're gonna need to get better equipment Looks for like this stuff. Looks like we made stuff. it here in one piece. Okay, so if it's a dock, we can fish for. Too, right? <laughs> she sounded so excited there. Um, so if it's a dock with like this little weaving wood thing in the middle, it's probably gonna be fishable from. Let's see. Golden catfish. Y a. That sounds. If it's golden, that sounds like it's probably going to be, like, expensive, right? There we go. That doesn't look like a catfish, so... I like the battle music. <laughs> I like the battle music for this fish. But yeah, we're not going to spend too much time fishing. I think this is mostly going to be me, like, what I do off-screen for this stuff. We can get a good meal out of this fella. There's a that pond tilapia. Was a true fighter. Um, I would like to get a gold catfish, though, because I, I feel like that's going to be pretty expensive. And it was YA, right? That's there new. I don't think it's a catfish, though. Uh, it's very tiny. Uh, this is extremely tiny. Uh, I also gotta remember to go back and talk to uh, that dude for, like, uh, more uh, information. And I guess stuff he'll sell me. Uh, Maybe he's just gonna give it to me. Oh, that was bad. That was bad. Uh, I pressed the wrong button. Now, I'm interested in uh, when the hell we're gonna be able well, to break that, that rock. Challenge. That went pretty well. In front of, uh, not in front of, but way back in that old area. So are these all marked on the map, these fishing areas that I've been to before. So like, not here. That's all frozen though, right? Oh, there is a fishing spot. We can't teleport there, but I'll go there later. And then there was one back here in the Cave of Solitude. Yeah. The fact that this place is called Cave of Solitude, I feel like it's special. So let's check this out. And, uh... We've reached our destination. I mean, it looks special. It looks like a great place to swim. What do we have here? Salmon, coral flatfish... Where should I cast my line? Right there. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Okay. Oh, we've got a lively one. Do we now? I mean, it's taking the the the, the rod down pretty fast, right? The line. After this, we will go back to doing our our th thing and going on with the main story. Okay, what the hell was this? Was it like the catfish? That's not a fish I see often. Oh, so it was a sea bass. Grilled or broiled? All right, let's get out of here. Our sea bream. Oh, okay. I think I'll try to make that new recipe with this. Sure. But I'll decide how spicy it is. So we can make a new recipe. So I guess we're going to camp then. Again. Because why not, right? And then we'll uh, sell the stuff. Uh. What new recipe, though? Wait a minute. What new recipe? There was a couple of blacked out ones. Or grayed out, not blacked out. This realm doesn't seem like such a bad place to camp in. Yeah, there's lots of plants and wildlife here. I, mean, I know. We've heard that one before. Oh, was it? Oh, it was this one. Cooking efficiency. Sure. Mmm. Looks perfect and tastes just as good. <laughs> I like the hand wave. Ooh, experience boost. Yeah, Kisara. Kisara, let's talk for a bit. And then we'll go talk to the fisherman. Oh. <laughs> Uh, 
It's not that hard, Elfin. I'll take watch tonight. It's okay. Uh, I do know a few people that were hooked in the face, Before though. Before we go, do you guys have everything? When fishing? There's something in the water. Oh, actually, an old, old friend of mine. Like, he had a, a fishing thing wrapped around his neck and into, like and just, like, stabbed into his throat. Um, think it's, like, just a hook, so it wasn't too bad, but it was pretty scary looking when he came running up. Elegant swimmer. Thanks. Is that all you're giving me? Got five. Uh, portly mudslider. Slinger. And... Overhill, Frozen Valley, Navarra Snow Plains. Okay, sweet. So yeah, at some point, I'll probably try and go to catch all the fish. Uh, definitely probably during record, like, not during, but like, in between recording sessions. How about 700 each? Jesus Christ, that's actually fairly good. And, um, you know, go from there. I'm assuming the more I fish, the better, not just rods that I'll get, but like the, the... The lures. Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. Well, there's something big over there. I just noticed none of you other Danans have spirit cores. Why is that? Both of my parents were part of the resistance in Calaglia. In fact, my birth was kept a secret from the Renans. Mine too. We always lived in hiding, so I never had a spirit core embedded in me like I was supposed to. What about you, Alfin? You were a slave in Calaglia before all this, weren't you? To be completely honest, I'm not sure why I don't have one. All the other Danon slaves around me did. I'm not really sure why I had this helmet either. Exception. They tended to keep their distance from me to avoid attracting any attention from the soldiers because of my mask and all. What about you, Kisara? Do you still have your spirit core? No. I was able to find a good Renin doctor who's sympathetic to our kind and had them remove it before I left. They did such a great job, the procedure didn't even leave a scar. That seems unlikely. One of the benefits of coexistence, huh? I know that once the spirit vessel was shut down, there wasn't much need for me to hurry. But still, I didn't like having that mark of servitude lingering on me any longer than I had to. Understandable. It may sound a little strange to hear me say this, but I'm just me now. Not a guardsman or a slave. I'm my own woman, and this is my chance to have a new beginning. That doesn't sound strange at all. That's completely understandable. This sure is one rugged road. <laughs> like me. They keep this at least a little better maintained, right? Why spend energy fixing that which is rarely used? Repairs require time and effort, which in our world means slaves, often in great numbers. Ah... For you, it may be a simple request, but that can quickly become another's difficult burden. I mean, fair enough. Nobody gains anything without someone expending effort. But, like, and they're getting you know, paid for it, right? Somehow that someone always ends up being a Danon, while the Renans are the ones who gain. True enough. Ideally, in a perfect world, I think it's only fair that the ones who need it should be the ones to perform the work. So us? However, when doing so could be dangerous like it is here, there are many who would prefer that it be others who risk their lives in their stead. So, what you're saying is that people will just put up with the inconvenience until someone else comes along to fix it for them? That's pretty true. Indeed. And it is those who can no longer bear that feeling that inevitably take action. Much like the Danans in our group do so now. As strange as it may be to hear such a thing from the likes of myself. It's true that most of the Danans in Calaglia have been resigned to just accepting things as they are. Still, we can't just blame them for... We can blame you, Law. What are you making that face for? You're not worn out already, are you? <sighs> nah, just regretting I ever said anything in the first place. Alright, so is that a, a big, like, enemy? No, it's just hawks, never mind. Oh, you know what? I never used my delicious red jasmine. Oh, we can get that stuff. I'm assuming you guys are going to be stronger versions of the Hawks that we fought in the past. Inhibitor Crystal. Okay, I probably should have read that. Hi, guys. How's it going? Are you new? Archer Heart. I have a bad feeling about this. So you are technically new. Going in. Rising focus. 
<laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't mean to start attacking the air like that. Make sure you heal me, Shion. They don't have armor, but I'm just using you for attacking. I guess I'm using these abilities until, like... I, I, oh, you know what? I wanted to do the training grounds. Oh, we'll do that later. Because you're dying, dog. Oh, okay, thank you. I'm not sure if I was dying there or not, but I'm assuming I'm not. Yeah, I completely forgot about the training grounds. Well, I need to get my boost up. Quite necessary when creating weaponry. So if I can get my boost up. Oh, hi, guys. Yeah, when I get my boost up, I'll go back to the training ground because you need to, like, knock them down. This is like a set encounter. <laughs> this is a pain. Why can't this Zoogle stand still? All right. Huh. Perhaps it's time I deploy my secret weapon. I'll stop it right where it stands. Oh. Oh, uh, Rioter Claw. The only boost attack. We actually literally just had a skit about that not that long ago. The tutorial start anyways. There's nowhere to run from my arc. When he slows down, that's our chance. Yeah. I mean, that's fine. Oh, yeah, do, the, do it again. You didn't stop it, Dahalim. It literally walked through it. There's a hurricane. Oh, I gotta do it on the other one. Never mind. Shut up. No, I didn't want. I, I chose the other one. I chose the other one. Damn you, auto targeting. Uh, Dolhalim's boost attack. Prehinder. When fast enemies like wolves or monkeys appear, these are not monkeys. These are bears. These are bug bears. These are not monkeys. Send in Dolhalim. His boost attack will nullify their evasive abilities and keep them from dodging attacks. I'm not gonna lie. As much as I like having Kisar in the party, I might put her in the back row. With Rinwell. <laughs> but Rinwell does so much damage, Kronos. You're right, she does. But, like, I, I need her to be able to, like, freaking use her boost attack sometimes. Like, regularly. They seem to get it faster in the back row. So, I don't know. Explosive ring? What the f fuck? Talking more pummeling. Cut them apart to your heart's content. Going in. Explosive ring! Too much to handle? More where that came from! Got some interesting okay, so explosive there, rings, my new I'm best glad friend. You're on our side. I'm simply glad to hear that I can make myself useful to you all. Huh? What's wrong? We seem to have come across some rather unusual objects. What? You mean that pile of garbage? Another man's garbage no, is another God, man's treasure. I assure you. Still, I've never seen anything shaped like it before. I'm intrigued. Uh. uh... What is it? Are you curious about this stuff, Rinwell? Uh, oh, uh, yeah, I think he might have found some old Danon relics. They look like the remains of a bunch of objects that disappeared after the Renans first invaded. And yet here I am, holding them without so much as a second thought. I imagine the sight must be unsettling to you. Not really, just that it must be nice to be a Renan who has time to indulge in stuff like that, unlike the rest of us. That's unnecessarily Are you interested rude. interested in this stuff too, Dohalim? Charmed may be a better turn of phrase. I simply love objects that can give me a sense of what their maker was thinking, the history that went into their creation. You see, we Renans have hardly any such objects that trace back to our distant past. I still don't understand what you two find so intriguing about it, though. They're history buffs. Why not? We're talking about our own culture here. I get that, but it's not like this stuff is any use now, does it? It's just old. Real old. Oh, but it does. Holding it in your hands like this, 
One can feel and engage with the distant past in a way no history book can ever accomplish. I'll take your word for it. Well, seeing as it's Dan in history, just make sure you're careful with it. He's gonna drop right, it, isn't Dublin? he? But of course. Uh, crocodile Crusher. Ages ago, this worn down hammer was used to beat back crocodiles. What? Uh, th <laughs> those skilled enough to dual wield it with it were allotted as champions. Oh, I wish I could dual wield. Artifacts confer special effects simply by having them, some of which serve as bonuses that can be enjoyed after clearing the game. Oh, okay. You can toggle each of these on, uh, these effects on and off in the artifacts tab. Wait, what? Uh, additional art panels. You can now set additional art panels. Press Y on the art screen to switch between panels. Arts that are set to the second level can be executed by pressing the L T trigger. Kind of like old school tales then actually that way. Not old, old school, but like, I guess Tales of Symphonia on was more like it. Increase normal attack limit. That sounds fantastic. You have nothing flagged right now. Which honestly is a little weird. But let's go ahead and get that. I sense a strange power from this. We can really make Demi weapons with this? muscle. All right, one second. Artifact list. Uh, art set plus one. Uh, oh, okay, 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 okay. So now I can switch to this. Uh, okay, cool. So I guess. Dragon Swarm. Oh, you have Explosive Ring! Okay, all right, so. Huh. We'll leave that there. We'll do Severing Wind. No, not, not, not. Go, go back, I completely messed that up. So we don't want Severing Wind there. We want Megasonic Thrust, and then we'll have Severing Wind down here. For some reason, I like the upper ones to be uh, like freaking on the low one. We actually can use, actually, we're actually at a good point where we can pretty much use, except for this, uh, the blazing sword with everything I do, which is great. And I'm assuming our boosts are maxed out. We'll go back later. Yeah. Visibility along this path will remain limited for some time. Really? Take care not to get ambushed. Oh, I, I never get ambushed. You know the terrain here so well. Clearly. Lords don't strike me as having much time for wandering in the woods. Sometimes I would take strolls along here when I wished to be alone. Oh, hey, right. You always did have a bad habit of disappearing without telling any of us guardsmen. Um Oh, there's earth spirits in there. Astral ore, okay. We need that for uh, crafting, I believe. You all new enemies. Ooh, and treasure. Okay. Hi, how's it going? Little help. Oh, we don't need no stinking help. Yo, that. <laughs> that is actually insane. I did die doing that, but at the same time, that was literally insane. That that ability just seems like super good. What? Bound? <laughs> I mean, these guys aren't new, but like the, the spirit dudes are. I mean, I kind of, I should probably wait to do that when they're on the ground, huh? Right, so they're not dropping, like jumping around. Oh no! I died again. What happened? Now you just pissed her off. But now you can't do that. 
toasty. Get toasty. Probably shouldn't do it like completely uh consider yourself finished. Uh holding it down on like random encounters. Right? Just let it do its stuff. I know fine weapon material when I That was a lot of experience points. Seven thousand gold. That was a lot of gold too. Um I have to ask though. Is that just from uh that must be just from the experience boost that we get from the food. Oh, that's really good. I should probably get more sea beams then. Because that seems like it's going to be really useful. Oh, that's new. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's like X Strike. I won't rest until I'm the best I can be. Still striving to be on par with uh, the where world? Where are we going? You simply can't be too strong when battle is a part of your every day. It's so, so that blue thing's gonna be gone. Here. I can feel my feet getting blisters. You get better shoes. That's not hiking for you. It can be pretty tough if you're not used to these sorts of trails. I take it you're comfortable with them then? Oh yeah. We used to run up and down these slopes all the time for our training exercises. Probably get yeah. great cardio. You weren't messing around. I can imagine doing that in that armor would probably give you quite a workout. The gunslinger. I have hey, to level up. In this world. Don't worry. I've got your back. Yeah, that experience piece is pretty good. Okay, which way are we going? Oh, uh, clearly to the dead end. There is a treasure down there. I'm assuming this is going to be more astral mass. We want to get these because this is clearly inhibitor crystal. That is not what I thought it was. I thought I saw a red chest. Oh, there is a red chest. Hello, one enemy? How's it going, dog? Honestly, it's a little weird that you just decided to come and fight me by yourself. Oh, that's rude. Thanks, Shion. And just like that, I'm back in it. Is every shield you own that big? Here. You want to try holding it? It is bigger than Rinwell. How do you even walk with this thing? The shield is literally bigger than Rinwell. Hi guys, how's it going? Good to know my training All right, that's a ton off. of experience points. What are we getting? A uh, stone wing mantle. Okay, so that looked like a piece of equipment for Rinwell. It's not. Oh, it's for Doholim. Okay, cool. Thus our strength yet grows. Your livestock already. Well, that's great. How's it going, guys? I'm just gonna like I'll fight you. All right. This could be so let's head back. Oh wait, we have a thousand CP. Oh, do I have nothing set to? Huh. Okay. Roasted chicken. Apparently, I I was working on this one. Yeah. You know what? Yeah, that one, and then we'll do shockwave flash. And do that with anyone else, right? <laughs> uh, Law. I did that with Law, but he's not learning anything anyways. Uh, reduce, reuse, recycle. Sounds good to me. Okay, so we're just going... There's a lot of different places that we can go to. So I think the obvious ones for me is just go down to this one down here. This one goes down. Hmm. More Dan and ruins here too, I see. What were people even thinking back then? Trying to build anything around here. M maybe they just had that much time and energy on their hands. Maybe. It's another red herb, red sage. What's That's great. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a hundred. This thing. It's a red sage. You know that. We've had plenty of them. Uh, we're gonna avoid encounters right now. You know what? Let's just go down this one over here. I'm sure, I've built up a sweat with this hike. Rest assured, we have reached the top. It's all downhill from here, quite literally. <laughs> so Mahog Sar's just up ahead then? Indeed. Oh, that's fast. Look, across this mountain is the Lord's Keep. Descend. Just jump. There we go. What's this? Uh, astral mass. That's good. 
All right, this seems like it's gonna What's be a this boss. Place here, some kind of old house. Hmm. I don't know about that. Hello. Guess, what are you doing yes. here? Pro I should have probably let her stop uh, stop talking before I did that. Thank you for the raging storm beak. Ah oh, shit. And now I really regret interrupting her. Astral ore. Uh, I'm gonna avoid these encounters for like right now. I'll get them on the way back when we walk out of here. Unless they touch my butt right now. If they do that, I'm gonna be very upset. Oh no, they're leaving. Definitely want to get that in a minute. Oh, there's a red chest. Okay. Oh, apparently I already beat these guys here. That's weird. I thought I didn't yet. But yeah, they're all dead. I've killed them all. Scaled crystal. A tough crystal that can disperse impact against it. Its physical structure is so strong that it's believed to be indestructible by physical means. Another scaled, uh, scaled steel. Woo, a level four one, I guess. is probably pretty good, right? All right, is this gonna be the ultimate weapon in the game? Uh, Stonewing Mage Coat. So that is that is for you. That is fairly good. Found some equipment. Let me take a look All at right. it. All right. So let's head on back. Yeah, I decided to clear up the enemies here when I uh, was doing that one. Uh, except for those guys, because apparently I forgot they existed, but that's fine. I, uh, I'm just gonna kind of, like, bypass them. There you go. They're not that bad. They don't give that much experience, either. Kind of glad I came down here first. Because, like, I initially was just gonna pass this up to go to that dead end over there. The enemies in this area will, I will do, uh, when I'm pretty much done, right? So, hmm. There's two different ways here. Well, we're gonna go down to this dead end first. Grab these peppers. That enemy looks strong. Ow. I bet it'll be worth our while to fight it. Oh, it's a rare dude. Well, not rare, but special it won't dude. Be easy. Man, Kasara. With this. Oh, that's a lovely score stronger. and goddamn experience points. Yeah, Kasara uses her goddamn like Ms. the Guard almost every battle now. She's fantastic. The, the whole charging thing's a little bit, uh... Oh, we can just jump down there, huh? I don't know about that one. Um, oh, man, this blue thing is gonna go away by the time I get down here. Yeah, that's a shame. That's fine, though. Inhibitor crystal. Oh, you guys mad? Yeah, come and get me, bro. He says, running away. Get another dude that's just... Hurt. Here. Uh, Tempest Stone, thank you. Is that the only thing around here? Was just that dude? I mean, I'm not complaining. Uh, so which one should we go for first? I mean, I got all these enemies up here that I want to fight, but at the same time, those peppers already respawn, huh? Do I want to go up there, or do I want to go down to that little cave structure? Actually, you know what? We're not going to cut this battle out. Let's let's watch this battle. <laughs> I want to see what the AI does. Uh, I'm assuming I still have to use the boost attacks. So like, no, I yeah okay no I do use the boost attack. All right, cool. So are you going to use? So I used I still use the boost attacks. My god, Alpha. <laughs> you just you did not use your you still use the, the blazing sword. That's cool. And your your dodging is okay. No, it's not. Okay, so I need to use an orange gel. We only get two of those left. That's kind of insane. And you don't take advantage of your counter. Oh, 
Don't use it there now. Dude, oh, um, okay, that one kind of worked because he... Nice because he's not that bad, I guess. No one died. These are the easiest enemies, though. I still got a ways to go. Uh, how do I change that back? Uh, how do I change it back to outside of combat? I guess it doesn't matter. Oh, actually, what was that? Uh, status? No. This is the status screen that I keep forgetting we have. Confirm title. Oh! Oh, okay. So we're like almost actually we're more than halfway done with titles. Not with you or you. Definitely with you and you. And we really just got you, so that's not surprising. Huh. Well, I guess the, the auto battle's not too too bad. I wanted to see how the the, the the AI did, right? Like I want to see if they were as good as me, you know. The master of combat. You think that's the right way? Or is like going up there gonna be the right way? It doesn't really show me. So I, I feel like going down is gonna be the right way. So let's go up. I mentioned earlier, I would love to be able to dual wield, but I, I kind of get like the blazing sword takes, you know, Elfin's life force, given that it's burning him alive. But at the same time, hell, it's just like, I don't know. It would be kind of like a cool, like, special ability, like Mystic Art. But still, I don't know. Or just give me two weapons. This, when's the last time we had dual wield in Tails? It's Lloyd. Just Lloyd? No. No, I might be forgetting someone. Guy was single. What is this? We're in the mountain. Gold chunk. Gold chunk. Gold chunk is ready. Um. Or. Why does this look like a like a special arena dungeon? What's that big tower over there? Yeah, I don't know. I was kind of hoping you guys would actually like uh, enlighten my ass about that. Judging by the stench, I'd say the animals at the ranch are all grown now. Cool. Oh, can I jump from here? I might be at a dungeon that I might not supposed to be at just yet. That's fine, though. Hi. Can I make any of those new weapons? Actually, can I sell that gold chunk? Well, I don't know how much that gold chunk is worth. I think the copper trunks only gave me like a thousand, though. You know what? We can, we can just double check that. No. So, uh... Yeah, okay, so gold chunks at 3,000? Yo, that's sick. Hey, lemon gels. That cool, refreshing gel. So we got some armor for everyone that I will probably buy. Uh, can I make, I can make this. Enhances my wind arts. That's sweet. And equip, thank you. Uh, we can do this, which is a dope-looking shield for sure. Nature's Beauty. We need a, the ultimate one, right? That was the next one in the line of uh, weapons. Or not books we needed to show that lady. So I feel like we can... Yeah, we can upgrade everyone's weapon. That's actually quite the increase for you, Doholim. Yeah, that's actually a huge increase for you. Now we need Astral Crystals, which I'm pretty sure we had, but we used. 
Well, that's fine. All right. Uh, how about ranch? Not ranch. Uh, accessories. Get protect rings. Physical damage minus 20%. That... That is good. All elemental damage decreased by 20%. Holy shit, okay. So, wow, okay. Um, wow, holy shit, okay. So I can make three of these. Honestly, I like this one, the attack 20. And I can make, a, I can make nine of these. At a few different levels. We don't have a lucky pebble. I mean, yeah, wow, okay. I wish I could make like a warrior, like protect ring or something like that that had 50% attack. I'm gonna have to look into that because those are really good. Oh, the chickens. Okay, so. I guess pigs this time. Sure. We should probably go get rid of that mouse, right? I always love the sound of hammers banging away. Uh, well, we can rest here first. And then we'll uh, go back to the ranch because there's a fast travel point here. Aw, who's a good boy? Wait, why am I petting you? Because Hoodle is super goddamn adorable. You jerk. So this was really good. I need to get more sea beams because it's really good. And it lasts 10 minutes, which is fantastic. We'll do this one for now. This shall suffice. Please, everyone, have as much as you like. Can I buy sea beams? Uh, Kisara. Kisara, let's talk for a bit. Sorry for rambling on so much about my past earlier. Perfectly fine. Don't sweat it. It was fun hearing you reminisce about the good old days. Come on, you don't have to pretend with me. I know I can tend to... go on sometimes, when it comes to my brother. You said it, not me. Anyway, I don't think it's something for you to be embarrassed about. <clears throat> hey, Alfin. When you were a kid, was there ever a time when... You had to bury someone younger than you? Maybe, but well, amnesia. It's hard to say. I'm guessing that you have, though. Yeah. During the previous crown contest with the Lord before Dohalim. Life back then was... truly hell. <clears throat> I think... that's why I tried to ignore what Megal was telling me for so long. Because I was afraid of going back to such a dark time. People do that a lot. Losing hope. They will ignore I red flags. In our paradise just so out of much, pure hope, pretty much. I doubted the one person I should have trusted most. I don't blame Lord... Blame Dohalim for that. I simply didn't want to face facts. And I ended up trying to project my ideals onto everyone else. It's strange. Whenever you and Dohalim talk about men and Sia, it's always like it's some big failure. We're talking about fixing 300 years worth of damage here. Isn't it a bit optimistic to think it was all going to be resolved after only five? You might be right. Maybe it was a mistake when men and Sia... No. When I decided to stop seeing the darkness in our society. I have to admit the truth. To myself, first of all. You're not close to Kasara. Take watch tonight. It's okay. Yeah, I mean, like you can talk about like story writing and stuff like that, but at the same time, in reality, people will Rise ignore. And shine. We're almost ready to leave. Obvious red flags when it comes to like things they are proud of or happy for. We've gained a f a decent amount of levels in the last few uh, episodes. It seems like we, yeah, we gained like three. We need to get more sea bass. <laughs> we need more sea bass. Uh, yeah, there was a fast travel here, point, right? Oh, we have astral ore, not crystal. Yeah, so there's a fast travel down here, and there's no goddamn things. Where was I going? Oh, the ranch. Right, I was going to the ranch. 
Great range? Oh, we're still in Minnesota. My god. Where's the range? Range. Gotta get that mouse out. I mean, really, it's not a mouse. That is a rat. <laughs> that is a rat. Um, Finally. where you at, dog? If Who is a mouse? We flown with the wind to get here faster. We did fly with the wind. I, I know there's a mouse here. This cat is having some troubles. I, it said there was a mouse here. Did we eat the mouse? Oh, it's right there. Get the hell out you of better here. Not come back. Got it? Dick. All right, let's go back. And end the episode. Thank you for watching. I will see you all next time. Have a great day. Bye. Finally. If only we could have flown with the wind to get here faster.